all right guys in today's video we're gonna go ahead and look at the brand new i believe dark emperor island whatever it's called i remember but i already started some challenges but today we're gonna go ahead and look at the update and see some things but right now we're gonna go ahead and look at the brand new secret pets that came out with this update so let's go ahead and trade old saucy i mean he's pretty lucky he had to go for these secret pets himself which is insane also i did trade for a giant balloon dragon if you were wondering but here are the pets oh i kind of spoiled the stats a little bit but it's all right so let's go ahead and check these pets out these pets are pretty rare None of these are easy to hatch. Like, I believe the Dark Dominus is 1 in 20 million. And the other one is like 1 in 50 million. I don't remember the stats of either. What the? Oh, it's not the way at the bottom. It's level 1, that's why. But, uh, let's put these on. Alright, let's see what they look like first. Oh, I have my pets off. Alright, let's turn that on really quickly. Alright, whoa. I didn't even realize it was a rideable pet. But look at that Dark Dominus. I like that. Alright, so let's unequip these. We now see what they look like. And let's see the uh, their stats. All right, so let's look up dark. So it's uh, easier. Yeah, all these dark diamonds I have. This is insane. All right, but look at this. We have 416,800 bubbles just with power three. There's new uh, poison and stuff like that. Bubbles, we'll have to get in. That's a later. But we have 1.5 coin multiplier and diamond multiplier. And we have a pearl multiplier finally, but pe pearls. And it has 772,000 pearls, which is the best pet currently in the game. Cause this is actually better than the popcat um maxed out gigantic popcat and with the bubble potion i believe it three times just the bubbles so it removes the part three so i believe it's like one not even one million i think like if we do the math it's six hundred thousand bubbles per click with just that one pet which is insane because it's not even a shiny it's just a regular pet not it's like a normal and then we have the huge dark dominance which is not leveled up currently which is kind of is because I'm bubbling. Well, that's like it's not equipped. Okay, it's good. So base stats are sixty-five thousand, which you probably if you leveled it up, max leveled and all that, probably around three hundred thousand bubbles. And I'm not gonna do everything else, but I mean, the stats are pretty insane for pearls. That is insane. The pearls are insane. All right, so let's look at the dark dominus. All right, this is actually my favorite pet. Like we never had a huge dominus yet, but I would love to be able to have the rideable feature on this pet. It would probably be better than having the rideable feature on the Dark Destroyer, as it is like more easier to ride around. But yeah, let's go ahead and check the stats out. So we have to check the gems. So gems, we have 1.7 million. That's actually more than what I get with my entire team in total, which is insane. But well, not really. I don't remember honestly. But here we have 1.6 million. That's a lot. That's a lot for one coin. Alright, so now we have to go ahead and check the pearls because... Alright, hold up. Let's check the stack. The stack right here. That we gotta check. Okay. And we got 8 million. Alright, hold up. Really quickly, let me just go ahead and turn my quality down because it's kind of really laggy. I don't know if you guys noticed. But yeah, let's go ahead and check. I don't know if this is the game or the server because it's kind of laggy, but stay with me, guys. Alright, so let's go to Atlantis. So now we have two pearls here, which is insane. Let me see the name real quick. Dark Dimension. Okay, I was kind of close. Dark Emperor, you know, kind of same thing. Uh, yeah. Alright, so now, while, while we're in here, we'll check the Dark Emperor stats. Whatever the thing was called. Dark Destroyer, right? Alright, so... 3 million. That is insane. Alright, how about the chest? 21 million. That's a lot for one pet. Also, just leveled up, surprisingly. Oh, that's why it's got whipped. Duh. Alright, so here we have the Dark Destroyer. This pet is insane. Look at... Ooh, I can equip it. Ooh, I like this pet. Looks pretty sick. It has a little tail in the background. That's insane. So, let's check out the stats. Alright, so we have... 15 million on that one and then we have 108 million that's a lot that's a lot of pearls for one pet i'm not gonna lie i mean that was probably more than previous secret pets that we have seen in this game pro stats because the previous easter pets they didn't have our uh, pro stats which is kind of sad but i mean can't complain all right so that was 9 million it's obviously more than the level 2 dark dominus so and then we got 3 9 million on that one all right that's kind of insane I wish there was like a tiny version of each of these pets. Like this is the legendary, right? And then this is probably would probably be a godly because the dark the godly is a dark phoenix, which is you know it's insane. But let's check out the, the the difference of the sizes. All right, all right. That's kind of like two times the size, kind of like two times the size, which is insane. Those pets are pretty awesome. So like, I'm gonna go take a few pictures and I'm gonna show you guys the rest of the update, which is insane because these there's a lot of new features. Like it's a lot of content in this update. So yeah. All right. So now that we took a couple of pictures and we checked out the brand new secrets, let's go ahead and trade the guy back his pets. So you thank you to him because he's kind of been giving us a lot of secrets lately that have like we've been able to showcase. So thank you to him. And yeah, we kind of that was crazy. Those pets are insane. Whoa, he's giving me a shiny huge hell axolotl for free. Dang, appreciate it, man. That was, that's insane. That's a that's a good pet. Not really good, but it's like kind of rare because it's kind of hard to etch that pet. They're 1% and, you know, yeah, you get the point. All right, so now that we've actually checked out the secret pets, let's go over to the Dark Dimension area now. It's kind of it's kind of insane seeing two portals here. 
honestly nobody was expecting like a new world uh you kind of you kind of think of this world like the shadow realm and bgs which is insane because you actually do quests it kind of makes you want to play the game a lot which is crazy and we have a limited time egg here it says it's lasting for two weeks so i'm guessing there's gonna be eggs coming in and out if you're kind of like shadow realm was and we get to hatch those pets so yeah i'm completing these quests recently 2000 eggs and 10,000 eggs usually the hatch ones are easy because all you can do is just go ahead and hatch and you leave computer on for a few and you go do some something like homework or anything that you have to do like something important that you need to do to finish you can have this in the background so you're basically doing two like killing two birds with one stone kind of so yeah so this one i keep getting a lot I pick up 600 coins it's kind of like uh time consuming but it's pretty easy if you really think about it like uh i think the best way to do the coin one is obviously sky uh, not sky island spawn road because it's such a huge area and a lot of uh coins spawn in there but here we have a, a shop here people have different things in their shop but for me i have mega luck boost which is insane that's pretty powerful and then we have power two which i have five of those and it resets in two days and i think everyone also has this option it's just a gigantic dark robot starkeep himself said this pet was worth buying 37,000 points you might think that's a little amount but these points are pretty hard to get i've been grinding these quests for so long today and i've only gotten to 4,000. that that's not much that's like at least like not even 10 percent that's like five per, not even that's probably that's probably more than 10 percent uh at least like 15 percent i've only done not even 15 percent that's like 12 percent because four thousand is like not even twelve thousand like you know you get the point right and then here we have the brand new brewing which is insane because we have shadow poses i'm guessing uh from what i've heard it brings the max level from 25 to 50 on a pet which if you really do that it's it's kind of the same thing as the power three uh because if you remove the shadow potion it removes the power three if you put a power three potion it removes the shadow it kind of has the same benefits plus the power three is easier to get than a shadow shadow really doesn't have a benefit it, unless it's probably something more than that i don't know but then we have bubbles which uh basically three times the amount of bubbles you have on a pet so let's say for example i have my gigantic balloon dragon so right now i have power three which is basically two times everything on my pet so if i remove that that would be a hundred and something 55 155,000 bubbles and if i put a bubble potion i'd be blowing 450,000 bubbles i believe with that one pet which is insane so imagine that on something like a bubble not bubble uh easier bunny lord which is like the best bubble pet right here that everyone can get it's insane so imagine like imagine everyone every single pet on my team with a power not power three uh bu a bubble potion that would be a lot because at least pet at least each pet will have 300,000 that's at least 3.5 million bubbles right there just by easily putting potions on these i mean you can kind of say trash but they're not really trash because they're secret pets but they have doodle -doo stats they're like 200,000. that's not much for me to get to 3 million click and that's insane and then these quests are kind of hard but you know it's kind of fun not gonna lie doing these quests and plus i mean you get something out of it you get a gigantic plus spark keep yourself once again i said he said it is worth the time and everything so i mean if you guys do want a video on how to do all the quests like specific areas and what you need to do to collect coins and patch epic pets and let me know down below in the comments i'll make a video probably to let you guys like help you guys out because i know a lot of you guys want that gigantic and it might be hard not knowing what to do especially because i took me a while to figure out what to do but yeah like i said if you get anything like good coins the best area to collect from is spawn world and if you get anything like diamonds if you do have robux go to the vip area and if not go to fairy world there's obviously going to be a lot of diamonds here because like, this is like the diamond world basically so yeah just go ahead and do that and if you have the robux to spend on vip go ahead and do that but either way i would do fire fairy world because it spawns in a lot faster than what it would in here but there's a lot more in here that spawn than it do it does in um fairy world so that's pretty much it for today's video if you guys enjoyed then make sure to leave a like subscribe and turn notification bell on time post a brand new video but anyways guys peace